Today is the deadline to reserve your ticket in time to meet the early bird deadline for the 2022 Topeka St. Jude Dream Home. That's the early bird prize. I'm pretty excited for it. And by doing this, you'll be eligible to win a $10,000 gift certificate to Carpet One Floor and Home. Let's tell you some details about the home now. The home features four bedrooms, three baths, a large butler's pantry and prep kitchen fit for entertaining. An oversized luxury master shower, a wet bar in the basement, and in every bedroom, there will be a walk-in closet. Remember, your ticket goes directly to St. Jude Children's Research Hospital. They work to treat and defeat childhood cancer and other life-threatening diseases. Families never receive a bill from St. Jude for treatment. Travel, housing, or food, giving families the time to focus on their child. St. Jude is working to drive the overall survival rate for childhood cancer to 90% and won't stop until no child dies from cancer. And you can go to fox43topeka.com or call the number on your screen to reserve your tickets. Less than 2,500 tickets remain. Tickets will sell out, so the sooner you reserve your tickets, the more prizes you could win. And joining us now is Katie Nelson with the Topeka Area Building Association. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks for being here. Of course. So for those who may not know, tell us what your organization is all about. So the Topeka Area Building Association should be your one and only first stop shop for anything housing related. You know, we can help you with building, remodeling. Um, you just need a contractor to help with some blinds or some flooring. Um, I can help you with that. Uh, our office is on Fairlawn, so it's 1505 Southwest Fairlawn Road. Our doors are open Monday through Friday. So if you want to build, you want to do anything with your home, looking at a DIY and you'd rather just get a contractor to come in and do it, we're your people. <laughs> okay, and talk about how you guys got involved with this year's dream home. Um, well, I have to say it started five years ago when Mike Drapay built the first St. Jude Dream Home. So Drapay Construction, this is their third time, and then Mark Bowling did twice. Um, so when they first started, they said, you know, we want you there from start to finish. You're a big part of the building industry in town. So we just decided that, you know, we were going to help out and assist as much as possible. So, you know, we've this year have helped with a lot of the marketing and helping just kind of line up. Oh, we need this still. And oh, well, let me see what I can do. So we're just trying to assist St. Jude in getting the people there in timely fashion and also helping with some of their marketing needs that they've um, needed for like, you know, Facebook and LinkedIn and stuff like that. So we try to push out as much as possible and even um, talk to the people that are helping Helping just so that they know what a timeline is and where we need to go with that timeline. Yeah, and you guys are definitely playing just a huge role in this. Talk about what this means to you to be a part of such a big organization. Well, can cancer doesn't discriminate, so it doesn't discriminate color, you know, um, age, <laughs> male, female, it, does, it doesn't care. So I feel like if we can help the kids, you know, I've met some of these kids that have survived. You know, they've been to St. Jude and they've, they've made it. They've, they are the success stories. And the fact that these kids don't look at any of it being a disabling at all is so energetic to anybody who can talk to these kids. So, you know, it starts with our kids. I have several families who have, you know, either lost ch children to cancer or adults. So anything that has to do with cancer, um, I kind of just say, okay, I'll help. <laughs> yeah. And um, real quick, we're running out of time. Um, from your perspective, how do you think progress is coming along on the home? It's beautiful. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I want the kitchen and the pantry. <laughs> yes. I know our meteorologist, Becky Taylor, and I keep just uh, we're so amazed at that kitchen. <laughs> yes, it is. It is beautiful. Um, you know, I think it's a good house. Um, Jerpay Construction, they do great building. So I think that this is just going along kind of seamlessly this year. So yeah. it's been really good and really been a lot of fun to watch it go up. So, okay. Yeah, yeah definitely exciting to see that yeah. come up. Um, Katie, that's all the time we have. Thank you for joining us this Thank morning. Thank you so much.